Maxim Online's Jordan Burchett. Jordan Burchett. Jordan Burchett. Jordan Burchett. And sports editor Jordan Burchett. Tobu, take it away. As you all well know, as six of you may already know, the CSTV studios have been positively abuzz in anticipation of this coming Saturday, quite possibly the biggest of the season. To the west lie the hearty blue collars of Pitt. To the east, the moldy blue cheese of Penn State. I think that if you could get a window into the kinds of late night Cinemax screenplays that were unfolding in the mind of an emotionally unfaithful woman, you'd wash your eyes out with soap. <laughs> we're here at Professor Tom's in New York City on an NFL Sunday where we've spared no expense, exhausted every CSTV resource in hitting the campaign trail. New Orleans, we've all seen the images of this devastated town. Maxim Online decided to observe the aftermath for ourselves firsthand. Six months later, when we were certain we could order a bowl of disease-free gumbo, and the devastation we witnessed was devastating. All this was showing class. No just class. Show your class! Show your class! Buy some, come on. No, it's Maxim, Mama. Maxim. Are you doing it, Mama? You guys think we're all like, oh, that's so dumb. <laughs> Not anymore. Okay, moving on. This is Tony Gonzalez of the Kansas City Chiefs. Drew Brees, quarterback for the New Orleans Saints. The legendary Joe Montana. Have you ever been in a fight? I always tell my boys, that if you do it right, you only got to be in a couple. What are your three favorite cereals? I'm not sure exactly what they're called because what my wife does is she pours them in those little, like, uh, little containers. She's giving you generic cereal, man. What's your girliest trait? My girl. <laughs> I cried at the notebook. What's the first rap lyric that comes to mind? Go. To all the ladies in the place with style and grace. What's yours? If you're having girl problems, I feel bad for you, son. <laughs> That's not bad. Hit me! And I've never actually yet in my life to meet a woman who has enough bags. For the true last minute lazy guy or recently freed hostage or whatever who hasn't had the chance to shop, this is the one gig model, it's the shuffle. It holds up to 240 songs or approximately three of Meatloaf's greatest hits. You're not even kidding around, are you? Oh no. When I first saw the commercial for the iPhone, I thought it was really cool. So cool, in fact, that I didn't need to do any more research before running down to the Apple store, waiting in line for 19 hours, and putting down $600 for one. This is a man who's been out in the grind brave the cold, the elements, and things that he can't even mention on TV. It's like the streets of Mogadishu out here. <laughs> Jordan, what do you think? Like it or not, politics is big business now, fueled by competing interests, TV ratings, and even money. Well, what's the difference between choosing CU for its co-eds and moving to Colorado for its outdoors? One. Hills and valleys, jills and sallies, it's all the same, really. But what are you going to get the kids to run this offense? The entire state is built for this offense. You're going to have to reprogram an entire generation of Nebraskan youth. I'll bet he simply can't wait to get out of Southern California, where a resurgence of talent, fan interest, and winning has hampered his pursuit of fecklessness, futility, and fugly cheerleaders. Well, I ask you, when was the last time you saw a woman greet one of her girlfriends how they sag in fatty pants? <laughs> um, yeah, haven't. not so much. The federal government has promised billions in undelivered aid, but sources close to the administration say they're fearful the money will only be spent on foam hats and dick nose glasses. Happy Mardi Gras! Reporting from New Orleans for Maxim Online, I'm Jordan Burchett. Okay, Jordan, you get the last word. I don't give a shit who's playing in the Super Bowl. I'm not in it.